all right so let's look at this figure so this figure is a quadrant that is one fourth of a circle all right now from this side let me make it oh from this side to let me see key is is radius okay and from this side oh to let's say p to is another radius it means that this side that is ok is equal to op all right now to get x and y we need to know the radius of this quadrant so if i able to calculate the radius it will be easier for you to know x and y because this side is a radius why this side is radius assuming the radius is 50 it will be 16 plus x equals to 50 okay then you solve x then you do same to 12 plus y is equal to 50. so we need to know the radius of this quadrant in order to get x and y all right so let's move on all right now remember this figure is not 100 percent accurate okay in other words not drawn to scale all right we know from this side to this side is also another radius okay and this side is 12 so this side is 16 because you have this side goes to this side okay so we can apply pythagoras theorem here so which says the square of the longest side that is r squared is equal to the sum of the squares of other two sides so that is that so let's solve for r so my r will be square root of 12 squared plus 16 squared so my r will be so 12 squared x calculator work so that is one four four then 16 squared will be two five six all right so one four four plus two five six will be 400 all right therefore my r will be square root of 100 so that is 20 so plus or minus 20 bit length cannot be negative so the answer is 20 so my r is 20 okay so we know the radius to be 20 okay all right so we are to solve for x and y okay and we know from this side o to let me make it p o p so op is 12 plus y since op is a radius and o let me make it and o and 2 is a radius it means the lengths are equal and therefore we can equate this one to the result here 20. so 12 plus y let me change the color so 12 plus y will give me 20 okay therefore my y will be 20 minus 12 which is 8 and let's look at this side so this side okay to 16 plus x that one two is also a radius so 16 plus x to is a radius so that will be 20 so my x will be 20 minus 16 this is equal to 4 all right so my y is 8 and my x is 4 therefore x plus y x 4 plus 8 which is 
12. All right, so x plus y is 12. All right, so thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more exciting videos. All right, so.